This is the Bay Hill Club and Lodge, Arnie's Place. It just has a special aura about it, and it has everything to do with Arnold Palmer. For the past 37 years, Arnold Palmer has hosted a PGA Tour event at Scenic Bay Hill. I enjoyed the Orlando area, and I made an offer to buy Bay Hill and eventually bought it. The work that has gone into building this tournament, as well as the club, has been pretty exciting and is also very rewarding. Some of the biggest names on the PGA Tour have made the Arnold Palmer Invitational presented by MasterCard an annual stop on their schedule. We tried to emulate you, Mr. Palmer. With the hope of being crowned the champion by the event's esteemed host. This event means so much to me uh, over, over the years. It's a very special place. Again at Bay Hill on the 72nd hole. To do it there and to have him on there on the 18th green, it just means something more to us as players. Just takes it to another level. I have a lot of great memories from the Arnold Palmer Invitational. I got an invite from the King himself back in 92 and then eventually won there in 98 and 2010. So it's been a wonderful journey for me there. Mr. Palmer is awesome. I've gotten to spend a lot of time with him, play golf with him, and uh, to be able to play his tournament, his course, is pretty special. It's one that I've always loved. I've never taken that week off. I've always enjoyed, you know, the test and certainly what Arnie brings to it. Going to Arnold's tournament's always been fun. It's awfully important for us as players to honor what he's done as a player and uh, what he does for the community. Tiger would make the coveted climb to greet the King a record eight times and is the only player to have won at Bay Hill three years in a row. Like so many players, of his age, he grew up watching Tiger make birdies here in the 72nd hole to win. Maybe it's Matt Every's turn. Matt Every wins Arnold Palmer's Invitational for the second straight year. Matt Every is one of three players to have won here back to back and can join Tiger as the only other player to press palms with Palmer three straight times. Yeah, that was cool. He. Uh... You know, he's a legend. It was awesome. And then it was kind of my hometown event, so that was cool, too. But to win his third straight, he'll have to take on a field fit for a king. 17 major champions, along with 17 of the top 30 in the FedEx Cup standings. But only one handshake with the king. It's kind of hard to win awards, but coming off the last, and, and Arnold Palmer standing there and congratulating you for winning his tournament and shaking your hand, I mean, it was obviously something really special. And that is one shake that every player wants to make. It would mean a lot if it wasn't for Arnie and all that he's done. You know, we wouldn't be out here playing in front of so many people or in, on people's TV screens. We owe a lot to Arnold Palmer for what he's done for our game. He's a special guy. I'd certainly love to be uh, hanging with him a little bit on, on 18 green late on Sunday afternoon. That would be nice.